Welcome back to another FC24 player review. Today's player review is the brand new team of the season moment, Brian Brobby, so let's get into it. Starting off with Brobby's stats, as you can see I played 5 games in rivals, scored 7 goals and got to assist. Now usually I do only play 3 games, but you will see in the gameplay the second game, my opponent quit literally from kickoff, didn't even get to play a single minute. And then I think it was my third opponent, he quit at half time just as I was getting back into the game. But with that being said, let's head into the gameplay. Okay, so into the gameplay for probably we go. As you can see, winning the ball back from Cole, and then somehow I don't even know how that's gone in. That's just. That's just this game being broken. Zambrotta into Brobby. Tidy little finish past check. This is the game where my opponent quit from kickoff. So that's why I went to play a fourth. And then this is the game where my opponent quit at half time. Brobby into Lukaku, who's actually very good. This is Inform Lukaku upgraded through the Serie A Team of the Season Evo. Brobby on the ball once again, holding off Kimmich. Through pass Kobel. Then Lukaku into Brobby, taking it past Cannavaro. Nice little finesse into the back of the net. Lukaku once again into Brobby with another finesse then Lukaku on the corner somehow I don't even know how but he still scored and then this is the final clip of the gameplay so I'll be back with the pros and cons in a second So now that you've seen the gameplay for Brobby, moving on to the pros. First of all is his 96 pace. Now his split is actually 92 acceleration and 99 sprint speed. So once you get up to speed, there's no one catching him. He's got incredible shooting. He's got 98 shot power with a marksman and 99 finishing. Otherwise his shooting's actually pretty low, but in game it's far better than it says then he's got good passing now this is what separates this card from his future stars evo because i believe that only had 71 passing so this is genuinely 10 times better then he's got great dribbling his lowest stat is his 84 dribbling but with the marksman that goes up to 92 and then He's got 99 strength, absolutely incredibly strong as an ox. He's got high low work rates. To be honest, I normally look for high medium with strikers because high low seems to be a bit dodgy sometimes, but for him, it seems to work. And then he's got four star skill moves and a four star weak foot. Now, I didn't really shoot on his left too much. So from the shots that I did take on his left, they were on target, but Unfortunately, he wasn't able to score any of them. On to the cons for Brobby. And for me, I think he only really has one. And that's his aerial ability. Even though he has power header, 99 heading accuracy and 99 jumping. Because he's 5 foot 11, he just can't win the ball. If the player's like 6 foot 4, 6 foot 5, he just struggles in the air. So even though... You look at 87 stamina, doesn't seem to actually bother him. I think that's because he has the high-low work rates. But in the air, even though he has 99 jumping and 99 heading accuracy, he just can't win the ball in the air if they have, for example, Van Dijk. So would I recommend using Team of the Season moments Brian Brobby? And in my opinion, I would say yes, especially if you do want a high-end striker but for very little coins so this card is between 30 and 35k at the moment he's just an incredible striker 
great pace, great shooting, very good passing, incredible dribbling, incredible physicals on paper, but his 99 strength is the thing from his physicals. Four star, four star. He's got high low work rates. So if you play him with a striker that has high high, then he'll be even better. I played him next to Lukaku who has medium low. So they both sort of stayed in the same position. Then he's got great play style pluses. He's got power shot plus, power header plus and quick step plus. Overall, he is just a really fantastic card. And for someone so cheap, I know he's going to be overlooked because he's only 90 rated. Obviously, on the screen, I'm showing you what he actually is with a marksman. So according to Footbin, he's actually a 97 rated striker. If you told someone you can get a 97 rated striker for just over 30k, then you would be telling them they're joking. But Brian Brobby is an absolute monster and I would highly recommend getting him on your bench, if not in your starting 11. Thank you for watching this player review. If you did enjoy it, drop a like, hit that subscribe button if you're new. But for now, I'll see you in the next one.